What's up guys, it's Captain Aries, and I am back at it again with some Fortnite today. I know it's been a while since I made a YouTube video, but that is mostly because I have been busy living in my new house uh, and trying to set things up there and make enough money to pay my bills and such. Uh, first thing I'm going to do is start off by trying to kill this guy in the lobby, if that's at all possible. Uh, as you can tell, maybe, uh, I haven't played this game in a long time, and I am actually playing with a bunch of randos right now, who I've never played with before. This is that new rumble mode, uh, where it's teams of 20 and it's the first to 100 eliminations wins. So, uh... I think right now, just I'm gonna look for a llama, because the last game I played, I actually found a llama like, right on top of Basketball Mountain, but it doesn't look like there's one there right now. I'm just gonna keep looking for llamas. I don't see any llamas. Llama, llama. All right, so I'm just gonna dive right on in here. Gonna head into this town on the edge of the circle. And I do just want to clarify that this audio was recorded after the match um, simply because I don't have the recording technology to make it possible to record it during the match and it's a lot easier to record it after the match. Uh, if I try to record it during the match there could be lag or anything like that. When I found that dynamite, I was like, oh no, this house is going to be empty. There's only going to be dynamite. And lo and behold, more dynamite. And bullets. Kind of getting upset, so I was just like, you know, I'm just going to farm some materials, some mats. I'm going to mess that up. I'm going to farm some mats and see what else is in here. And then, oh, lo and behold, my favorite gun in the whole game. The scoped purple AR. I love this thing. Oh my god. It is my favorite weapon. It's always been my favorite weapon since I first started playing this game like a year or two ago. And then I saw a gold AK and I was like, alright, that's it. I'm not allowed to die this game. I honestly can't remember if I did or not. And then I was like, okay, I guess I'll take this. Maybe it'll be like a secondary. Maybe I can sneak up on some people or something. And... And I saw this shotgun, and I thought, well, I don't really like shotguns, but it's better than the dynamite, because I hate dynamite. Um, I really prefer grenades. And then I went, ooh, look, upgrade. Just upgrade that real quick. So I'm just going to go and loot this building now. This was my ultimate goal anyways. If I can just, if I can jump up here. Okay, cool. And I know the enemy is probably going to be coming from that side, so I just want to put a wall up real quick, just in case. Loot this chest. Ooh, sniper. I'll take that. Because in the last game, uh, I had a hunting rifle, and I found out that I don't like hunting rifles. They are wildly inaccurate. And the scope on them is horrible. Doesn't really help me get anything with my scoped AR. So I'm just putting that up there just in case somebody from the enemy team decides to land on top of the building. And then, oh, oh don't forget to do that. And then, now I'm just going to basically just clear this building out. I pretty much have the whole loadout that I want right now. But I'm just going to clear this building out and see if there's anything else in here. And of course I'm going to get tons of ammo because in this game mode I've noticed the one thing I am constantly without is ammo, even though you land with all of your guns and stuff again. I just keep running out of ammo. And then I saw this, and I was like, you know what? Screw the silenced weapon. I'm just going to get a second AK. Because why not? And I don't know why I left that ammo there, but I did. Sorry about that. But I made sure to pick up that ammo. <laughs> and this ammo. And just check the basement for a chest. There's a chest over there. Might be something useful. Uh, wood. 
great. That's all I really wanted out of there because I already have a gold AK and a purple AK. Why do I need a blue AR on top of that? I just don't. I just don't. And then I see this and I'm like, what in the mother of... Use your imagination. I said some curse words. And I was like, alright, well, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to head this way. See if there's anything over there. And it looks like there's a teammate over there. So I'm going to head towards this teammate. Maybe they'll be helpful. We'll see what happens. And I was thinking when I was running along this, I wonder if he built this slowly, or she built this slowly, or if it was like all rapid succession, like diagonal stairs like that, because that's pretty cool and pretty impressive if they did. I've only seen that done once before. So I just was scoping it out. I was like, oh, that's probably where the teammate is. All right, I'm gonna head over there then. And I'm thinking, I'm just gonna build like a zigzag wall up that waterfall and uh, come in from the back there. And then I, I sort of heard something. I was like, is that, am I hearing my own flyer or am I hearing somebody else's flyer? And then I saw the shadow. I was like, oh, that guy right there. I, I missed twice, but hit once. Immediately built a little fort. This guy starts trying to go all pro builder on me. I just knocked him down and shot him in the head. He actually did drop some ammo and some metal. I was wondering if he was going to come and try and come back down and do that again. Um, so just to... Uh, I see this big ladder, and I was like, oh, he could probably land on that. Is he down there? No. That, it it kind of looked like a person, so I just shot it twice, just in case. But I saw this big ladder thing, and I was like, you know what? I need to take care of that. Nobody else is going to follow me. So I fixed that problem right there. And then I proceed to try and build my little zigzag stairs. Then I was like, what if someone tries to follow me up these stairs? I don't want an enemy to try and follow me up these stairs. So I just put some blockages in the way. And I was like, okay, I'll just put another one there, another blockage, and I'm here. I'm on the ship. And there's an ally there. And there's another ally off to my right. I'm going to go over to the fortress, see what I can get done. Ooh, more ammo. Always gotta get lots of ammo. I didn't even know I was at 6 out of 7 boxes. I was just totally focused on the game. I was like, where is this door? Close the door. Delete the door. And this is where things start to get sort of hairy. I try to hit this guy, but he glitches at the last second and I miss. I, I can't see him or hit him for some reason, so I was like, you know what, let's do it. I got my own thingies. I'm just going to get out the door real quick. And I'll wait for him. Meanwhile, my teammates are up there killing him, and I didn't even know. I was sort of just like, I only have 25 health. 20 health, excuse me. Does that say 20 or 25? 20 health, yeah. I only have 20 health. So I was kind of just like, alright, I'm not messing around with this guy. I'm going to wait for him to come out this door, and as soon as he does, I'm going to gun him down with my gold AK. And oh, did he just set those traps? Little did I know, they were set by teammates. I found that when I got up there. But uh, I just wanted to take him out just in case. I thought that the enemy set them and I was going to go up there and wreck his world with this gold AK. And I was like, oh no, what's going on? Oh, it's an ally. And they, I realized that there were allies up there <laughs> trying to do things. I was like, okay, I'll help. I keep, my screen door is like not secured to my door and I keep hearing it go, tonk when the wind blows and it sounds like somebody's knocking at the door and I have to remind myself that it's actually just 
my crappy screen door that I have to fix. So I was like, this is a great fort and all, but there's a point up here where enemies can land on, and uh, I want to get to the high ground. Get to the high ground. Oh, there's a guy. There's a guy coming in. He's going to try to challenge me. My teammate's going to face him, right? Or not, or I'm just going to have to double headshot him, just two-tap him. Clap them cheeks. So, this part is sort of lame. Sort of just like, look around for shots to take. And miss all of them. Decide that no one's going to come up there. I try to help these people, but these two trees are in the way. And I see people down there, but they are really far, and the bullets from snipers have a lot of drop at that distance. Even when you're on top of a mountain, which makes no sense to me. Hello, gravity. Hi, this is Captain Ares. Uh, I would like to talk to you about physics, if you don't mind. Uh, and physics say that what just happened with that sniper bullet should not have happened. I'm shooting from above. There should be no bullet drop. So, I decide I'm going to come over here and see what this guy's looking at. This robot guy. I can't really see anybody because those damn trees are in the way. So I just decide, screw it, I'm going to go next to those trees. Solve the problem. At this point, I have very little shield, very little health. And I'm sort of just like, okay, I'll get revived at some point. I'm like, nobody's hitting this guy. I can hit this guy, right? Jump at exactly the right time! Okay. I don't understand how people do that. And then he disappeared! He disappeared! Tried to fire a shot anyway, just in case where I thought he might be. But he disappeared. Not cool. I heard this guy coming down behind me, and I see this little fort over there. And I'm like, hmm, should I go to the little fort? No, I think I should probably just go down. Um, but I'll, I'll try and snipe some people from the air. Just nearly misses. Gosh, the reload on this thing is so slow. So slow. And then I see the guy on top of the tree and I'm like, Oh no, reload! Reload! He's a sitting duck! Reload! And he's gone. He's gone. Very disappointing. He probably heard the sniper shot or saw it go past his friend flying in the air and was like, uh, nope. I'm out of here. And, yeah, this is basically just, like, the next couple minutes of this are me trying to find a shot. Couldn't find a shot for some reason. So I was like, I'm gonna go up here and see what this guy's shooting at. Maybe he's shooting at something I can see. Something I can shoot at. Then he jumped off. And I was like, you know what? I wanted to go down there anyways, so I'm just gonna follow him. I'm going to have this guy's back, he's going to have mine, we're going to work together even though we don't have mics with one another, and even though we uh, we don't know one another and we're not on each other's team. We're going to figure it out. We're going to work together despite all of that. I see this guy. Clearly that should have hit him! How did he dodge at the last second? Not fair. Not fair. And there he is, and I just headshot him once and killed him. 96 to that. Boom. Chakalaka. And by the time I have reloaded, someone's already killed that guy. The reload on this gun is insanely long. It is absurd. And then I see this guy over here, and I'm like, that should have hit him. Why did he start floating up right there? Whatever, I'll hit him with my favorite gun in the game and win the game. Yeah! <laughs> Mad respect, bro. Mad respect. And I wanted to throw a tomato at him, but just couldn't. Alright, well, like and subscribe. Peace!